I'm sure all of us, we have seen what is going on on the social media. You know, personally, I, I am not a person who like you know, to talk on things that are happening. But for this one, I have to say one or two things. First of all, I want you to know that uh, no one can destroy the name T.B. Joshua here on earth. Whether they like it or not. I have a reason, people of God, for me to say that. We have seen uncountable miracles, not only miracles, we have seen the support, not within Africa, even in Europe. Personally, before now, I never knew that in Europe there are people who are homeless. I came to know this through Prophet B. Joshua. Can a man bribe the whole entire Southern America to go and fake a miracle? The answer is no. All these, you know, disciples of Prophet B. Joshua, they were nothing before they, you know, they joined Prophet B. Joshua. We know them through Prophet TB Joshua, even our brothers, the wise men, the prophets like Chris, Rassini, name them. We know them through Prophet TB Joshua. And anywhere where you see these people, they always introduce to say, I am the disciple of Prophet TB Joshua. I think uh, that documentary from BBC will make the world to know how Prophet TB Joshua impacted so many lives here on earth. And there's no, no one who can destroy that foundation. The man, in fact, is a sheer waste of time talking about the man who is no more. He came as a prophet and he finished his work and he has gone back to be with the Lord. Let me say this again. We know the disciple of Prophet T.B. Joshua. T.B. Joshua had a lot of secret disciples. Even you, you are a disciple of Prophet T.B. Joshua. Even me, and I'm proud of, you know, of that man. I respect him. He is my father. If you hate him, you hate Jesus who sent him. Another point. I have been to Scorn, you know, so many times. You see a man from another country, who has never been to Scowan, who has never, you know, met Prophet T.B. Joshua. You go together. In your eyes, you see the man being prayed for and get healed instantly without meeting this man. I have never seen a man like this one. If BBC were interested in the life of Prophet T.B. Joshua, they were supposed to make a documentary of charity work in his life and the healing and deliverance in his life. Why must you pick few individuals and you post it to say, a court? If Prophet T.B. Joshua was a courtist, how many courtists that are in the world? I have never heard Prophet T.B. Joshua teach all of us to say, go and rape women. Go and blibe this one. His word was always love and Christ. Love and Christ. Love and Christ. Today, I want you to know that the devil is a liar. The life of Prophet T.B. Joshua is beyond money. It's beyond anyone who may think like you can destroy T.B. Joshua or people start rejecting him. In fact, we are, you are making us to love him more. These, all these people that say, you know, you know, are masquerading all over the world. Even our brothers in the Europe, they followed him there. And no one was forced to stay there. You request to stay there. It's either they will reject you or accept you. A man who is not even here, who cannot defend himself. You start calling him different kinds of names. And I want to warn our brothers and sisters. God is the defender of his people. 
Some of the things that you are doing now, you are just creating problems for your future and the future of your children. What this man has done to humankind, I have never seen a man of God who can give beyond Africa, who can build schools beyond Africa. Hmm. So, I want to encourage you. They want to blackmail the prophetic ministry so that those who are babies in Christ will start now doubting everything concerning Pentecostal prayer or prophetic what? Prayer. But as for me and all the children of God who shall stand and defend the truth. And I want you to know that they will see a lot of prophetic ministries even after his life because he was a seed of prophecy. And that seed has been planted all over the world. The more they are talking about this one, the more they will see miracles and wonders happen through prophetic. Mm -hmm. I am not ashamed to say that. I am on the camera. I am not ashamed to say that. I have seen uncountable good things. Remember what happened to Haiti. Prophet Tibi just sent a flight in Haiti. Remember what happened when it was time for uh, Ebola. Prophet T.B. Joshua chartered a flight. Name them people of God. Ecuador. Philippines. Go and watch Prophet T.B. Joshua. You see, you can't see what people are talking about. Our sister, she started a long time ago. I have, you know, some copies which I was given by the man of God before he died. Titled, Beware of blasphemers. I have them. They started a long time ago. Others came back to confess, to say, please, we were paid. Who believed BBC? We believe Jesus, not BBC. BBC is not our master. It is Jesus who is our master. If you want to know the truth about any man of God, go and ask Jesus, not BBC. BBC is a business. Are you there, people of God? Yes. yes. Go and ask who? Another thing I want to remind you, people of God. The problem in our generation is that if one is educated, it looks like they can even interpret spiritual things, which is not proper. I cannot interpret law because I am not a lawyer. It is the doctor who can diagnose you with the problem in your blood. But today you hear a lot of bloggers talking about spiritual things which they cannot understand. Being educated doesn't mean that you hear from Jesus. God can use anyone, even those who are not even educated. So this is my message, people of God. Let's stand together and continue praying for school and family and the woman of God in the synagogue. It is not easy where you know you have lost a man and after two years or three years someone come and say prophet tb joshua this this and where where are you all that time where where are you where is the evidence i have bought it you have bought it why can't you report there and then to say i have bought it after the man is gone now you are saying i have bought it you are even crying i pity you god is the defender of prophet tb joshua he is going to defend his legacy. And we shall stand on that legacy. And more are yet to come. In Jesus' name. Thank you.